phenylalanines, and this would be part of what we call the Fujiana trace fossil assembly. And here's another set of phenylalanines burrows. <laughs> so, Kyle, you can point them out as yeah. they come on up. There's another well burrow to planolites of flattened horizontal burrows. You can see some really nice ones here in the bedding plain. Scale. <laughs> oh, look at that. But I'm not the only one going to go through all of those things. <laughs> yeah. That's coming all the way out of the top of the mountain. Yeah. On the order of the Montoya group, way up at the top. Wow. <laughs> we had not been exposed to that group yet. The what? The Montoya group. Ah. That is the... Huh. Okay. We got two of us here. <laughs> I know. <laughs> okay. Um, next thing is here is to me somewhere right in here is where we have a transition mm -hmm. from the stuff you can't see anything in to the stuff you can start seeing bedding and sedimentary structures. Yeah. And that actually is identifiable, traceable mem uh, subunits of the Bliss sandstone. And um, anyway, so here you notice there's more thicker silty beds and the sand beds aren't as well cemented. So right here, there's no sad structures, but right above us, I can see a bunch. Uh -huh. So we have, so even though this is more sandy, this isn't in the same class of structure as that. Right now, really, all we're seeing is burrowing and bedding. Okay. So far. And, but here are uh, trough cross bedding in this bed. See these gentle swooping troughs. Oh, yeah. And above trough it. Trough cross bed, trough cross bed. Burrowed horizon, that's a scolithos burrowing. This is classic scolithos burrowing between the trough. If you look at these, you have burrowed horizon, trough, burrowed horizon, trough, burrowed horizon. So it's a, it's a very distinctive pattern yeah. of bedding and burrowing here, where you have obviously very intermittent deposition. So you move the sand and it, and it must be pretty high current energy because it's got it's pretty coarse. And then it stops and gets burrowed. Moves, stops and gets burrowed. You can sort of see that here. As we go up, keep looking. So trough cross beds um, on the bed that I'm stomping on. Mm -hmm. I'm actually going to get a GPS from the last one. Yeah. Uh -oh. 
Oh. Drop the hammer. Story of my life, Rip. At least you don't leave him behind. Right. Well, At least you can hear him like, fall. The hammer's like scattered over the rock chimney over the years. Cross bedding. <laughs> 